So this is Raven's recovery vlog, but it ended up being all over the place. So I was about to not really post it, but I already spent time filming everything. So here it is. Enjoy the video. <laughs> this is Raven's recovery vlog. Um, hopefully in a couple of days, Raven will be fine. But right now, uh, Raven's been still feeling a little under the weather. I've just been pretty much just cleaning up, reorganizing and stuff like that. And uh, Raven's just been <laughs> laying in bed um, and she's like drooling. So her drooling is a good thing while she's sleeping because it means like she's not dehydrated. I've checked her gums and everything uh, because of her vomiting and stuff, you know, she would be dehydrated, but she kept her water down this morning. Um, and I just gave her some more water before leaving. She was readily willing to drink water. And so uh, she seems a little bit more active now that she just got up. Um, it seems like she wants to play, but I feel like she still probably has like a stomach ache or something like that. I'm driving to the grocery store to grab some Pedialyte just to get her some like electrolytes uh, and give her some more water. And uh, I was told to give her about like a tablespoon of food. Like a tablespoon is just a tiny bit like this. And I have a little bit of like rice and chicken. Um, so I'm gonna give her that when I get back home here. Yeah, I'm gonna go grab a few things here first. I haven't eaten anything since last night. And so I'm like really hungry also. And it's like 2 p.m. right now. And so yeah, midway through the day already and I haven't eaten yet. Um, I guess I can just call this fasting. I used to do this anyways. Um, and I probably should start it up again. <laughs> this should be good. The prices in the grocery stores seem to be rising fast. So the bundle of firewood that I saw was like $8 and normally it's like $5. So it's gone up $3. I don't know what the percentage that what that would be, but that's that's a high like price increase. Um, the food and everything else is like that right now too. Like this whole supply chain thing really seems to be happening. Um, I'm not really sure how heavily affected everyone else is going to be. But right now, it appears that it's starting to happen. Like this this month and the coming two months, it's gonna be bad, I feel like. I keep hearing about it and um, I want to be prepared. Um, I'm gonna see if I can buy like, like prepared food already or something or like freeze dried food <clears throat> in like large containers or something like that just to have it as like a safety net um, and then I want to learn more about food preservation and I want to share it with you um, but yeah let's uh, get home feed Raven give her some Pedialyte I gotta make a sandwich for myself I'm hungry <laughs> So when I got home, Raven kept her water down, which is good, um, and she seems a lot better now. Um, otherwise, I have a small bowl of food here. It's just rice and chicken. Um, and then here's the Pedialyte. Apparently, she's supposed to have this entire bottle, but I'm a little bit concerned about that. Um, so I'm just gonna give her a little bit, uh, little by little throughout the rest of the day. Okay. So yeah, she appears to be hungry and active, seems well. Um, right now, I think it's around like 3 p.m. or something right now. Yeah, and now she wants to play. We'll take it easy though. I don't wanna kinda like get her stomach to be pushed around too much. I wanna 
yeah, I want her to take it easy. So hopefully she keeps this down. I'm gonna let her um, kind of hopefully digest this food. And in like an hour or two, I'm gonna do another update, maybe like two hours or so. Probably gonna give her a little bit more, just about the same amount. And hopefully she uh, keeps it down. And if she does, I'm just gonna continue increasing the amount of food. And um, yeah, and hopefully she gets better soon. But let's make a ham and avocado sandwich. I'm hungry. <laughs> Food raven? No. <laughs> Not, here, move over here. See, like I really want to give her some, but yeah, she. I, I'm not going to. Normally, I do. Yeah. This is such good bread. <laughs> like I love this. So just avocado like that. And normally I would give her some of this too. <laughs> no, Raven. No, you can't have it this time. So yeah, it's just a turkey, avocado, sort of French bread uh, sandwich. Mmm. Mmm. That is so good. I'm sorry, Raven. Like, I want the recipe for this bread. Like, this is the only bread that I really, really enjoy. And it's from Cub Foods. And it's a local store. And, um, yeah, like, no other place makes, like, good bread like this, in my opinion. It's always 99 cents. Mm. Perfect. giving Raven a walk now. This has been one hour since she's in. She's held everything down so far. And she's been fairly kind of active and herself. But right now though, I'm a little bit concerned because she's slowed down a little bit and kind of seems like she wants to puke. Back home, it's a relief. She's fine. She didn't puke or anything. And she's pretty active, but I still want to take it easy. Alright, so it's been about three and a half hours actually. And uh, I have some food for her. Um, this time I put a little bit of water in it. But it's just a real light layer of rice and chicken. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna die. So, uh, okay, turn around. I'm gonna die. Okay, I'm gonna die. No, I'm gonna die. See, she, she, she's really hungry. Now, turn around. So she's been able to keep everything down so far today. This is her second meal. This is good. So, yeah. I'll feed her again, maybe at like 10.30 or something like that. And I'll give her a little bit more food. Yeah, I'm happy. My my overall mental health has increased <laughs> because Raven's feeling better. <sighs> I really want to give her more food and I feel like she can probably handle it, but I want to just stick on the safe side. 
Like she's really hungry. I know she is. <laughs> Poor girl. You good, Raven? Good? All right. Eat your toy. Come on. All done. So I actually have decided what I'm going to do with my shed extension now. I am going to do a M roof essentially. So the overhang above me right here, I'm going to pretty much cut off and then I'm going to put a beam over it and then I am literally just going to build another shed right next to my shed but then um, it's going to have just an uh, opening right here so there will be just a door here and then I'll have an exit door in the back um, that can only be opened from the inside. And so the main shed will have a door that leads in, but then this extension here won't have a door coming out this way. It will be a back door instead. Um, but aesthetically, I think the, the letter M roof, right, is going to look better within the neighborhood. And it's not going to be an eyesore. And, uh, and, a, and the city will like it a little bit more, even though everything will still be with code, you know, like, um, I don't need a permit to, or like, I don't need a permit to build what I'm building. Um, and I was planning on just attaching like, um, some plywood, plywood sheets from like the edge here of the, right by the overhang and then just kind of angle it down. But I think that makes it look too much like a house like a mini house and so uh, I would prefer to have a double peak and so that way it'll look a little bit better and it'll still kind of look like a shed it'll look more like a shed than if I had it just straight out like that so yeah I'll see you in a couple of hours maybe th three four hours It is 9 p.m. now, and Raven just finished eating. She's kept everything down so far throughout the day. I'm quite happy and relieved. I'm gonna feed her again in about two hours or so. Just a small amount. And hopefully we can go back to a normal feeding schedule tomorrow. Uh, but I'm going to be feeding her only a bland diet for the next few days. But yeah, she appears to be good. I'm happy. So it's the following day. It's Monday morning and I've been uh, walking Raven and everything and she's been doing good. She hasn't pooped yet, but everything, everything seems to be normal. Um, and yeah, I'm going to continue feeding her this bland diet. It's <laughs> all it is, is just chicken and rice, but I'm giving her a whole lot more this time. Um, this is her sort of normal portion. All right, turn around. <laughs> Okay, left, left, okay, good girl, okay, so yeah, she's extra hungry, but she's doing well, and so for tonight, I'll be giving her this same portion also, and then uh, I think I'm going to incorporate her food again, like her normal kibble and stuff, uh, with this, maybe tomorrow or something. And uh, just little by little, and I'll transition her back to her normal food uh, within like three, four days. But yeah, thanks for watching. I appreciate everyone's uh, like support and um, concerns about Raven. I will try to see if I can get some really good videos up on YouTube soon. Um, I'm going to have like a few days off here and there, and so I'll have time to make some decent videos hopefully <laughs> mm, all done <laughs>